what's up guys welcome to ncx tech and today in this video we're going to discuss on gnome customization so in this video basically we're going to discuss on what are the customization options that are available for the gnome desktop environment out of the box how can we extend the customization level using the gnome tweak tools and also i'll show you how can we manually install gnome themes gnome gdk themes gnome sale themes and other icon themes for the gnome customization okay let's get started so here you can see that I'm using the latest Ubuntu LTS 22.04 with GNOME 42 desktop environment. And by default, GNOME offers a very minimal options for desktop customization. So we can find this from setting here. So under appearance, there you can see that we can change the color accent, light or dark theme, desktop icons. There we have some customization options for the dock. So whether we can enable or disable auto hide dock. Also, we can set the icon size and its position. So by default, it's on the left. Also, we can disable the panel mode. So we can get dock like this. And now you can extend the customization option by installing GNOME Tweaks. So here I have installed GNOME Tweaks. So from here, uh, we have some more desktop customization options under appearance so there you can see we can choose the cursor themes so by default ubuntu uses the arrow theme so we can choose whatever we like icon themes and the cell themes so this is disabled by default also we can change the background and for lock screen as well so to enable sale theme, so we need to install a GNOME extension. So for this, go to browser and then go to GNOME extensions. So from here, first you need to install the browser extension. And I recommend not to use this default Firefox browser. So with this snap version of Firefox, we can't install GNOME extensions. So after it's installed, there we have user themes. So to install user themes extension, just turn it on. So after it's installed, so again as we go to GNOME Tweaks, so from there you can see that now we can change the GNOME cell theme as well. And using this GNOME extensions, so there we have extensions. This is a GNOME extension manager. So make sure you have installed this already because using this extension manager we can remove or disable the installed gnome extensions so there you can see user themes which i have just installed so we can turn it off as well from here or we can remove this and to install other gnome themes manually uh, we can find it on other third party sources like gnomelook.org so this is one of the best place to find gnome themes so from there you can find themes for your cursor, docs, other GNOME extensions, GTK themes, and GNOME cell themes. So first I'll show you how to get different cursor themes for desktop. So just click on it. So from there you can find different themes for the cursor. So suppose if you want this theme, just click on it and then click on download. It's Volens cursor theme. So now it's downloaded and it won't appear here automatically. So for this, you need to open the file manager and then make sure whether or not you have this dot themes folder and by default it's hidden. So there you can see that we don't have, sorry, dot icons folder. So if it's not there, you need to make it dot icons and now you have to extract this downloaded folder into the dot icons folder so now this folder is here so let me go to the tweaks from there under appearance so now here we have this volantis cursor theme so to apply this cursor theme just click on it 
so now you can see that this new course theme has been applied and in order to get all the full icon themes just click on it so they will have different icon themes so let me choose this candy icons and download this and now open this file and let's extract this to the same folder dot icons extract it here so now it's done so again let's go back to Twix so there under icons so we don't have it yet so I guess I need to close and open it again so under appearance icons so there you can see candy icons just select this so now you can see candy icons in the desktop and let's install some other gnome cell themes so from here we have gnome cell themes so you can choose any one you like so let me try this big short theme download to apply this theme first we need to make sure that we have dot themes icon so we don't have by default so let me make this dot themes folder now we are going to extract this file here this big short theme so i'm going to extract this inside the dot themes folder so there we have extract this now it's done so to close this tweaks i need to close this and open it again so now under appearance so under the sale theme so there we have big sure theme Let's choose this so now we got this mac os like theme let's install gtk themes so let me install this white short theme download this and again i'm going to extract this on the same folder that is the dot themes folder so now it's successful and let me do the same thing again so there we have white shore so now we have mac os like theme so for this i guess this big shore icon theme suits the best so let's download this so now let's extract this again to the dot icons folder also we can download different wallpapers for our desktop from here so let me download one of these so let me try this so let me set this as a wallpaper so let's open twix again and let me change the icon theme so let me change this icon theme to big short dark so to make it look like mac os so guys in this way we can customize the gnome desktop so i hope you find this video useful and if so please don't forget to like this video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more linux tutorial videos thanks for watching have a nice time